yesterday, um, and the Optimus team was up all night uh, making this video. Um, the Optimus team has done an incredible job. Um, so just, yeah. In 2025, robots might actually outnumber humans in some industries. A bold idea tied to Tesla's Optimus bot. But this isn't just any robot. It's a revolutionary leap forward, ready to change the way we live and work. Can it solve labor shortages, boost safety, and reshape entire industries? Let's dive into why Optimus is set to take over in 2025. Unlike older robots built to do just one specific thing, Optimus is designed to handle pretty much anything you throw at it. Whether it's folding laundry at home or tackling dangerous tasks like handling toxic materials, it's a robot that's made to adapt. But here's what makes it truly special. It doesn't just perform tasks, it learns how to do them better every time. Think about it. Instead of being stuck with pre-programmed instructions, Optimus is smart enough to understand, react to, and even predict its surroundings. It's more than a machine following orders. It's a robot that gets smarter as it goes. Imagine watching it not just adjust to unexpected changes, but handle them like it's second nature. That's the kind of versatility and intelligence that changes everything we ever thought about robots. The thought of a humanoid robot becoming part of everyday life feels like something straight out of a sci-fi movie, doesn't it? But the Tesla bot isn't just an idea anymore. It's here, and is built to do more than just impress. The robot is a real-world solution to some of society's biggest challenges. Imagine robots stepping in to handle the boring, repetitive, or outright dangerous tasks that humans would rather avoid. From folding laundry to operating in hazardous environments, Optimus is designed to take over jobs no one wants but still needs to get done. And here's the kicker. It's doing this in ways no other robot has even attempted. Its all-around versatility makes it unique, but that's just scratching the surface of what it can do. Tesla is using everything it's learned from developing artificial intelligence for self-driving cars to bring Optimus to life. The same advanced neural network and algorithms that let Tesla vehicles navigate roads are now being used to train this humanoid robot. But here's the big question. How do you teach a robot to handle unpredictable chaos of the real world? This is where things get really interesting. Tesla's approach involves a mix of teleoperation and hands-on learning. At the CyberCab, or We Robot event, human operators wearing VR headsets and motion capture suits stepped in to guide Optimus through tasks, one movement at a time. It's like showing a toddler how to do something instead of just telling them. It takes time, but the payoff is huge. And while it might sound tedious, the process creates a foundation for Optimus to eventually learn and act on its own. It's not just about teaching tasks. It's about helping the robot understand how to adapt when things don't go as planned. That's the kind of training that sets Optimus apart. This method of teaching by example isn't just innovative, it's absolutely essential. Robots can't rely on rigid programming to handle every situation, especially in the unpredictable ever-changing environments of the real world. For instance, Optimus has already demonstrated its ability to learn how to walk, balance, and even interact with its surroundings. These aren't easy feats. Walking alone demands an understanding of weight distribution, balance, and forward momentum, all while avoiding obstacles. Watching Optimus take its first tentative steps feels like witnessing the future, an AI-driven machine learning to move with the grace of a human. But walking is just the tip of the iceberg. What happens when Optimus faces challenges that it hasn't been trained for? That's where things truly get fascinating, and we'll get to that shortly. For now, it's worth noting that every step Optimus takes isn't just a step forward for robotics. It's a leap into a world where robots can think, adapt, and truly function alongside humans in ways once thought impossible. This robot's journey to mastering the human world is only the beginning. But getting around is just one piece of the puzzle. The real magic of Optimus lies in his hands. These Gen 3 hands, recently unveiled, are possibly the closest robotics has ever come to mimicking human autonomy. Each finger has multiple joints, allowing the hands to bend, grip, and even spread the fingers apart. With 22 degrees of freedom, these hands aren't just impressive, they're groundbreaking. They can handle delicate tasks like threading a needle with precision, but they're also strong enough to lift heavy objects when needed. This kind of dexterity is a must for a robot designed to work in the human world. Think about how many different objects we handle each day, each with unique sizes, shapes, and textures. Optimus is being built to manage all of them seamlessly. But here's the thing. These hands aren't just about function. They're a key part of what make Optimus so versatile, opening up endless possibilities for what it can do. And there's more to these hands than it meets the eye, but we'll get to that in a bit. What's even more impressive is how these hands work in sync with Optimus's neural network. 
The robot doesn't just follow pre-programmed instructions, it actively learns how to use its hands better with every task. At the CyberCab event, Optimus was seen pouring drinks and serving food, tasks that demand not just fine motor skills, but also a sense of timing and human interaction. It wasn't always flawless. Sometimes the movements were a bit clunky, especially when faced with situations outside of its training data. But here's the key. Every one of those moments is a learning opportunity. Every single interaction feeds into Optimus' neural network, making it smarter and more precise with every task it performs. Tasks that feel natural to us, like holding a fragile glass or twisting a stiff faucet, are challenges Optimus is quickly learning to master. And here's the cool part. Tesla has equipped the robot hands with advanced pressure sensors, allowing it to adjust its grip perfectly to match what it's holding. Whether it's something fragile or something heavy, Optimus is learning to handle it all with ease. This isn't just about getting better at tasks, it's about adapting in real time to an unpredictable world. And that's a game changer. But wait, there's something even more exciting about the way Optimus is designed, and it takes its capabilities to a whole new level. Let's dive into what makes its physical build so extraordinary. The design philosophy behind Optimus is equally fascinating. Tesla didn't just aim to create a robot that works, they wanted a robot that works alongside humans safely. That's why Optimus is built to be lightweight and easy to overpower if necessary. Safety isn't an afterthought, it's a core feature. At the CyberCab event, the robots mingled with a crowd of untrained attendees, many of whom were experiencing this kind of technology for the first time. With aging populations and fewer workers entering critical fields, robots like Optimus could fill gaps in elder care, healthcare, and service industries. Caregivers, for example, could focus on emotional and medical support, while Optimus handles physical tasks like lifting or mobility assistance. Rather than replacing people, Optimus offers a way to enhance human effort and ensure essential roles get the help they need. And that doesn't stop at caregiving. Think about industries like construction and manufacturing, fields with high-risk jobs where injuries and fatalities are all too common. Optimus could step in to handle those dangerous tasks, making workplaces safer for everyone. And then there's logistics, where it can sort, pack, and transport goods faster and more precisely than ever. The real game changer, though, is its flexibility. Optimus isn't locked into one specific role. It's designed to adapt and take on multiple tasks. How many jobs could this robot revolutionize when humans aren't available, or simply unwilling to do them? One of the boldest claims made by Elon Musk is that robots like Optimus will eventually outnumber humans. While this might sound far-fetched, it's rooted in real demographic trends. With aging populations and declining birth rates, labor shortages are becoming a serious challenge in many countries. Robots like Optimus could step in and handle essential tasks, easing the burden on human workers. But Elon Musk's vision goes even further. He sees Optimus playing a crucial role in space exploration. Imagine fleets of robots building habitats on Mars, preparing the planet for future human colonies. It's ambitious, but it's within reach. As with any groundbreaking technology, challenges remain. Training Optimus to operate autonomously in unpredictable environments is a monumental task. Neural networks require vast amounts of data and continuous refinement. But Tesla has an edge here. The company's vast experience with autonomous driving has given it a deep understanding of how to train AI for real-world scenarios. This expertise is being directly channeled into Optimus, speeding up its development in incredible ways. Full autonomy isn't quite there yet, but the process so far has been nothing short of amazing. The unveiling of Optimus marks the beginning of a new chapter in robotics. It's not just a machine, it's a vision of what's possible when technology and human ingenuity come together. However, thoughtful innovation, planning, and addressing ethical challenges remain key in shaping this robotic future. Curious about how Optimus is changing the game? Hit like, drop a comment, and subscribe for the latest on groundbreaking tech and innovation. If you had a Tesla bot, what would you have it do? Let us know down below. And remember to be uniquely you.